Explain to me how you have a career in making everybody else's dreams in love come true, but in your own life. Then it's okay. While Mary was planning everyone else's love life, she didn't have one of her own. Mary, you haven't been on a date in two years. You can't avoid love forever. You know those who can't do teach? Those who can't wed. Plan. So Faith stepped in. <laughs> Are you okay? You saved my show and my, my life. You're the guy. I'm a supervising pediatrician here. Mary and I, we're gonna go to Golden Gate Park. They show old movies and uh, you should come with us. Well, we won't take no for an answer. This is by far the coolest thing I've ever done in this city. Wanna dance? Now, for the first time, her love life and her work life were a match made in heaven. You're gonna be a partner? I gotta get the account first. Meet my fiance, Eddie. Come here. Eddie, this is Mary, the wedding planner. You cannot sacrifice your entire career over this. We, we, we danced and it was nice, but nothing happened. I can do this. I can plan this wedding. What you have is cold feet. And I can treat that, that doctor like any other faceless groom. I am going to let her plan the wedding. And that's just what I'm going to do. Because I love a challenge. And because I'm a professional. That's why I love him. He gives me humanity. Hi. Columbia Pictures presents... I'm sorry. I wonder, is... Eddie gonna be the last person I ever sleep with? A story about finding love at the wrong time. What if what I think is great really is great? For the right reasons. But it's not as great as something greater. Your wedding planner took off. Mary? Yeah. Did you ever like somebody but the timing was off? I'm in love with your daughter. Way off. What the hell are you standing around talking to us for? Go and look for her. I like him. Jennifer Lopez. Do you ever think about that night in the park? Matthew McConaughey. I do. All the time. The Wedding Planner.